guitar skating when I was 21 or 22, I don't remember. I think it was 22. And I always loved watching figure skating and television. Outer, outer torque, outer, outer, and then now inner. Oh, that was better. That really was better. Oh, you yeah. lost yourself, but that was I a better turn. Myself, yeah. Okay. When I was young, mm -hmm. and then eventually I couldn't do it the, my whole life because I didn't have enough money to buy skates. <laughs> but eventually, after I started working, I buy like a pair of skates when I was 22 or 21, I don't remember. And then I started and my coach was crazy. So he said, oh, you're going to compete. <laughs> and then eventually I started to compete and then I, I couldn't quit competing. <laughs> so that was, I think that's my story. But I was like, I cannot tell you how happy I am doing skating. I love it. That's why I think it's more than a hobby for me. A little better, we were inside after, but we didn't do that dip in. Anyway, I met him at the Chandler rink, Chandler skate land. Mm -hmm. He was just pr practicing. I thought, oh, great, another another male to skate with, <laughs> another freestyle skater. I'm like, thank God. <laughs> I went and talked to him, and he said the same thing. He's like, oh, so glad another boy's here. <laughs> he was obviously getting back into it. He told me that he hadn't skated maybe in a while, like not recently, in a few months at, at the least. Yeah. And he was always working very hard to improve his stuff. And it was also interesting, he had a very unique international style. <laughs> he used his toe stuff on everything. It was very uh, confusing to me. But anyway, he's a, he's a very nice person when I first met him. He's continued to be a good friend and skater for our club. So I'm very happy he's here. Yeah? <laughs> nice. How do you know that he's funny? Because like he every time he says something like that, um like if you can't sometimes he like can tell like a joke or say something funny. And like you guys like, laugh. So, you guys will laugh. All of us laugh. Yeah. <laughs> how to do it here because it's a different language a different ring a different people yeah so at the beginning it was like okay I cannot do it anymore I give up and then I was really sick and really like with no expectations of anything and then eventually I came here a Saturday morning and <laughs> I talked with uh, I think it was Erica and she told me, okay, there's a bunch of people that skate, you should come. So they gave me the police number. And then I texted her right away. And she said, come next week and you can skate here. And, <laughs> and that, was, that was it. Then I, it was on Chandler Ring mm. that Sunday. And Brock looked at me and said, oh, good, another man and another skater. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> and eventually, I have friends now. So. That's the most beautiful, beautiful thing to have friends in the rink. 